Okay, at this point, we're logging into our OpenZipit system. We already have a Tversity or VLC or Boxy or whatever transcoder running on a server at home and a port forwarded to our router. We've moved location. We're now at Mark's house. And we are now going to trust the upstream capacity of the uh, Fios I finally got at my house. So, let's check this out. Log into the Zipit. Okay, that is done. Now I'm going to connect to my friend's wireless internet with the script I've previously set up. Should be connected. Alright, speakers are set up. Okay. And so, I load up the script I've previously set up to load the URL for this movie. Now, uh, Tversity particularly publishes its transcoded URLs as an RSS feed as well. So you command line guys can just wget that and then grep out any of the stuff that you're looking for and pipe it straight to the script and watch yourself a big long playlist full of good video. Now, I think you're going to be surprised at the quality of the video on this device, provided you have a good enough upstream or you're on the same local network as your transcoder. Let's check this out. Connecting. Fill in the cache. Kind of slow, but that's okay. Whoa. Look at that quality. Now, obviously this is a widescreen HDTV rip, so it's not going to fill up the whole screen. You can have your transcoder option set to fill up the whole screen, but I prefer to keep aspect ratio. So pretty awesome, right? No stuttering, full audio, complete streaming package. This is getting to be really exciting.